difference. <laughs> and look at this, no what real band would do this. But Molly has a CD available tonight. You should buy it because it has some great songs. Uh, we're going to do something a little special for you right now. Um, I don't know if you could figure that out from the ridiculous setup we have going on here. Um, uh, uh, Now I need you to count backwards from 156. <laughs> slower, slower, slower. Silently. <laughs> and silently in your head while we're playing. Uh, there's a band called They Might Be Giants. Uh, we are big fans of them. Um, there's, a, uh, there's an album called Apollo 18. It has on it a collection of songs known as Fingertips. I don't know how many of them there are, a lot. And they're like, they're like, what is it? That's right, 9,000. 9,000. Uh, and uh, they're all very short and they're all nonsensical. They were designed so that when you, when you sort of put the CD on, in those days they had CDs. When you put the CD on random shuffle, it would sort of sprinkle these little mini songs throughout your listening experience. Um, but I, I always preferred to listen to them all at once. Um, and so we're going to do this for you now. Uh, it's kind of like a circus up here while we're doing this, so... Um, then it smells like elephant poop. <laughs> Sorry! This clown saw us in sadness. <laughs> Which is, I mean, my other 10,000 maniacs. <laughs> Here we go. Fingertips. <laughs>
Now, the thing is, um, you know, when we decided to do this, uh, we didn't want to do it with just an acoustic guitar because we can't do it, it's too much. We needed to, we didn't have a bass guitar with us. So we had to go to the store and purchase this big bass guitar. We didn't want to invest a huge amount of money in it, so it's an extremely cheap bass guitar. Did you actually ask for the cheapest bass guitar in the store? We did, I felt so bad. I told them we would be smashing it at the end of the show. Yeah. Uh, we are not, however, going to smash it because that seems like kind of a waste. Um, instead, what we are going to do is uh, we're going to auction this off and give the proceeds to a charity called uh, Child's Play. Which provides uh, uh, toys and games and entertainments for uh, children who are in hospitals. Um, and uh, we've all signed this, I think, except for me, so I'm going to do this right now. It's also signed by John Roderick of The Long Winters, those of you familiar? Right on. He's an actual musician. <laughs> And again, I will, you know, it's not a great bass guitar. I'll be honest with you. Uh, but it does have very high sentimental value. Because, as you've seen, it's been played twice on stage. <laughs> once, once here and, and previously in Seattle uh, for the, uh, the Fingertips song there. So, um, I think we'll start the bidding uh, seriously. I'm serious about this. I think this is, this is going to be a very valuable item in the future on our planet. I think we're... Ten, ten dollars, you say? By the way, if it helps any, your, we, you can pay for your bid with credit card. We do accept that, so... Oh, 